Hey everybody, what is going on? Renee here. And Jay Wentz. And today we're going to be opening a pretty special pack, actually. I'm, I'm kind of really excited about this one. This is by far one of the most expensive packs out there. Wasn't in huge circulation. Um, it was very popular, though. Uh, and it is, some people like to call it Base Set 3. <laughs> It's um, called Legendary Collection. It does have some reprints uh, from... Well, it's all reprints. Well, right. <laughs> yeah, but, yeah. Reprints to an extent. It's, <laughs> they it's... change up some of the, the hollow stuff, which is cool. But it's got, what, base set through... It's, yeah, it's, it's like... Rocket? A, yep, base set, jungle, fossil, rocket reprints. But one fun thing about all these packs, if you ever opened one of these, you might have noticed that you got a bunch of Pokemon that were the same type. Also interesting, over at the bottom right, it says, like, wanna play. Have packs been saying that often? Uh, some of them have, yeah. Um, I know, it, it, it's just funny. This this set was built with a focus of actually playing the Pokemon trading card game. It's, like, super hollow. It's hard to focus. There it goes. And so you might get, like, a full evolutionary line in one pack, which is fun. Um, also, there's reverse hollows now. They have this, like, funny refractor look that if you see it, it almost looks like those stickers that you yeah. get on the vending machines. Yeah. Um, it's very different. Nothing else looks like also, it. Also, one thing I want to say, we only have this one pack. It's got the, the three original evolutions on it. But the cool thing about the, this set is every pack art had a group of Pokemon like this. It wasn't just one Pokemon. So there was yeah. like... Uh, uh, one, one with legendary birds. Yeah. One with all the starter evolutions. Yep. And then one is like Mewtwo, Alakazam, Machamp. Yeah. It sounds right to me. So pretty cool. And this is a set that I 100% have never opened in my life. I don't even know if... I, I might own a couple cards from this set, but I've certainly never opened it myself. So... Yeah, it, it is hard to come by. All right. Oh, come on, you. There we go. All right, <laughs> you can kind of see it. Yay! And he's got All his the, red cheeks the now. The rejoice. Come on, you. It's funny because um, normally when Renee's opening packs, I'll look at it from the side and I can see like a glint. And if I see a glint, I'm like, oh, I know that she's going to pull a full art. Right. But, but everything's pack, a full art. In every pack, the reverse looks like a full art from Yeah, the side. you're going to get one of those sparkly so, like, cards I don't know if you pack. can tilt it. Um, I could see like an edge. Yeah, you probably. can't really see it on the camera, but it's there. We I know Pikachu. it's coming. <laughs> Cedra. Voltorb. So we'll probably get a lot of electric Pokemon in this set. Bill! Bill. Hey, that card was awesome. <laughs> Magikarp. Electric and water. That's the theme so far. Potion. Two of the most, like, original trainer cards, right? It's kind of right. cool. Psyduck. Oh, poor guy's getting a headache underwater. Golduck. Oh, Golduck. Yeah, nice. see, like, there's a line <laughs> built into the pack. Another Psyduck. What? See, you're, what? you've already got part of the deck right here. That was, that was the idea behind these sets. <laughs> Hypno. Hypno. That's the rare. So you this so you got a rare and your reverse might even be another rare. I yeah. That's how that can work. So Hypno is the rare non-holo and <laughs> Raticate. So I guess uh, this would be what we consider nowadays as the reverse because the outside of the card is hollow and not right. the inside. But check so, that pattern out. The colorless ones I feel like shine even more. It's a shame we got something as dopey as Raticate, but um, yeah, these were pretty exciting. Like they look that, like fireworks. They, yeah, they kind of explode as you turn the card. It's but yeah, weird. this is the, the only set, obviously, to ever have this kind of hollow on it is, is Legendary Collection. And it's, it's so funny because as a kid I did not like how these cards look, but looking at it now I think I think they look awesome. I wouldn't want to play with a card yeah. like this, it'd give me a headache. <laughs> <laughs> but You'd it, have to play it in the non-reflective sleeve. Yeah, but it looks cool now. It's definitely a, a collectible type of card. But yeah. So yeah we got a Golduck line. Hypno. So that's kind of funny. We got the, the rare Hypno, which is cool. I like... I like the drowsy hypno line. Uh, Raticate, he is an uncommon, but uh, one of my one of my favorite looks attacks. Cool. Very few attacks ever in the game have a question mark on them. Oh yeah, Super you can Bang probably hardly see that because of the hollow. A, there it is. Mark. It's got a um, question mark next to it. It says, um, "Does damage to the defending Pokemon equal to half the defending Pokemon's remaining HP?" Rounded up to the nearest 10. So now, nowadays, that attack would just be blank. It would not have a question mark on it. Um, it's just really funny. 
And of course, double Psyduck. Kind of goofy, yeah, but... Gotta, gotta get them ducks. Look, you've already got a deck. There's, there's Golduck. Psyduck. Psyduck. Psyduck, Golduck. Deck. Golduck. Yeah, I don't know. It, these sets are a lot of fun also for drafts. They were. Um, oh, yeah. Because you could get like, full imagine. evolutionary lines. Problem is you can't draft anymore because it's like... Thirty plus dollars for one pack. For one pack, oh my gosh! <laughs> so yeah. Um, so that is it for legendary collection. If you have a chance to ever open these, I would suggest it just because it's such a different, different thing. You don't see it anything like this in, in newer sets or whatever. It's kind of fun. Um, but yeah, that is it for legendary collection. Thank you guys as always for watching. And uh, tomorrow, what have we got tomorrow? We've got something oh, really special tomorrow. Yeah, this is a. Uh... I almost debated not including this. Yeah, so we've been trying to do all of the English released sets. This was a set that was never released in English, but is too cool to pass up, and that is the Versus series. You can Look tell it. just by looking at it how thick it is. So you've got Legendary Collection, which was sort of catered toward playing the game. Each pack was literally like a functioning 30 card half deck. Yeah, this was um, only released in Japanese, but... um. They're really cool. We'll talk more about it tomorrow, obviously. Really, really cool mechanics. So every every Pokemon is not in, like there are evolution Pokemon, but nothing evolves in this set. Super yeah, so we'll talk more about that tomorrow. But uh, if you want to check this out, make sure you're subscribed. You'll be notified as soon as it goes live. And um, if you've missed past sets, you can go ahead and click the link on the screen as well. It'll take you to a playlist. I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video, and we'll see you tomorrow for this really cool Versus set.